Welcome to the Growth Hub. Ever wondered how the ADHD medication you or someone you know might be taking has a striking resemblance to cocaine, a notorious illicit drug, at a chemical level? It's a fascinating and unexpected connection, really. Despite their vastly different societal perceptions, these substances share an uncanny kinship. They both interact with our brain in a remarkably similar way, influencing dopamine levels and altering our perception of reality. Intrigued? Let's delve deeper into the chemical structures of these substances. Medications, such as Adderall and Ritalin and cocaine, despite their different uses, share a similar chemical structure and method of action. Energy drinks like Monster and Red Bull, amphetamines and cocaine act in the same way. Is giving our children cocaine-like drugs really the answer? In a previous video, we discussed the risks with dopamine agonist medications. These types of drugs increase levels of dopamine in the brain, with studies proving they can cause addictive behaviours. Are you sure this medication is right for your young son or daughter? Explore with caution. These medications have a direct impact on your brain's reward system, a complex network that controls feelings of pleasure and motivation. During addiction, the reward center is unstable, altering the number of active receptors to control neurochemicals. The key player here is dopamine, a neurotransmitter linked with feelings of motivation to feel pleasure. Both ADHD medication and cocaine increase the level of dopamine in your brain. They do this by blocking the reuptake of dopamine in the neurons, leading to an accumulation of this neurotransmitter. So what you experience is an enhanced feeling of focus or euphoria. But don't be fooled by their chemical kinship. While similar in structure, the effects of these substances on the brain vary significantly due to differences in dosage and method of administration. So what does this all mean? Taking a step back, we see that ADHD medication and cocaine share an unexpected link, a similar chemical structure. These compounds function in a parallel manner, increasing dopamine levels in our brains. Yet it's crucial to note that this doesn't imply they have identical effects or safety profiles. The shared structure is a fascinating scientific fact, but bears no implication on their use or misuse. Remember, the similarities in their chemical structures do not equate to similarities in their effects or safety. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Until next time.